Dear students, in this module, we are going to talk about the industrial and post-industrial societies. We have already talked about the hunting and gathering societies as well as uh, uh, horticultural and pastoral societies. So, so humanity, human beings evolved from those simple societies to very complex societies. When we talk about the industrial societies, we can see that uh, we can see around us that due to the advancement of technology, we are living now in much more complex societies as compared to the previous societies. Our social organizations have been changed, our uh, institutionalization have been changed, and our way of living, uh, and as well as the dependency on different needs have entirely been changed. So these bases are can be in today's society can be economic as well as uh, the social organization so in industrial societies we can see that econo our economy is not only dependent on the food or the collection of food as well as on the security and shelter but much more than that now we can see that our economy can be dependent on different social organizations like uh, uh, education system uh, like media, like political system, as well as we have specialized uh, economic institutions which are producing a lot more complex system of uh, uh, generating economy or this uh, economic system for us as compared to previous societies. So the development of uh, uh, industri industrialization definitely began in Europe where the complex uh, technology emerged to produce much more uh, than what we could uh, consume. So the, the availability of resources and the conversion of those resources into commodities allowed us, uh, the human beings, to, um, make, to convert them into the exchange value. And for that exchange value, we also developed a complex system of money economy. And that money economy allowed us to uh, have accumulation of wealth in a much larger way that we could have been, uh, we were not able to do that in our previous uh, uh, historical eras. Why? Because we were unable to convert those values into the monetary values, uh, which uh, because, because the surplus food and the surplus commodities are available which can be sold in the open or free market to convert it into uh, the economic values. The social organizations also became highly uh, distinguished and differentiated because we have now much more complex division of labor based on specialized tasks and those specialized uh, people are being trained in our educational institutions to produce uh, or to have their speciality on their distinguished or distinctive tasks. Uh, for example, uh, we can see that uh, in today's societies, uh, each factory can contain, can have a lot more specialist people to, uh, to finish their product. And by the time the product comes to the market, it passes through a lot of hands which can uh, manage the production process or the production system at each distinction distinguished stage by finely menu, uh, tuned uh, processes or tasks uh, like examples can be included the uh, suburb uh, urban or suburban societies uh, which are having a lot of factory areas in pakistan uh, when we talk about the post-industrial societies, it, these societies are uh, based highly on information technology, which is now uh, available globally. And we can see that po in post-industrial societies, a lot of dependence is on communication, on information, and on uh, media or social media technology. So uh, these societies can play uh, are, or are playing a vital role uh, to produce creativity, innovation and invention in almost uh, on daily basis which, are, which is taking to our societies to a maximum level of uh, um, specialization 
uh, as well as domain of labor. So education is increasingly becoming much more important in these societies uh, because every uh, specialist of uh, information technology need to be trained in highly specialized skills and tasks. So examples can include uh, people working in um, working in um, information technology uh, industry like Bill Gates as well as uh, people who are also working in Pakistan-based uh, media industries.